I am Andrew Dish Nation. John David, I was just with your father. So I got two Washingtons in one day. Oh. <laughs> How was it? Was he good? Was he best behavior? I mean, come on, freaking Denzel Washington. Come on. <laughs> yeah. um, okay. All right. Now, this movie fucking blew my mind because everything that I was thinking, both of you were freaking saying. Like, <laughs> So I guess my first question to Zendaya is, is in the film, your character calls people in show business a bunch of hoes. So am I right now being a hoe? Am I a hoe, Zendaya? Aren't we all? Is that, isn't that what she's saying? You know, to a degree, aren't we all? <laughs> and that's what yeah. like, stay in our lane, do our hoe shit. <laughs> um, okay, so I'll ask you the first real question is, how do you in your own life deal with the infuriation of love? Not the infatuation, but the freaking, I wanna tear my hair out, this person <laughs> is the worst, but I freaking love them. So how do you deal with that, Zendaya? Um, well, I mean, I, I don't necessarily want that uh, personally. I, 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 would, I would prefer the kind of love that doesn't make you wanna tear your hair out. That, that I, I personally am not a fan of, or don't, listen, they have Malcolm and Marie have their own thing, whether it's healthy or not, or is good for them or not. I still don't know. I still root for them, but I still don't root for them. It's very strange. Um, but it maybe is not a kind of relationship that I want personal. I'm a little bit more calm than both of them. Um, uh, with that being said, I don't, I don't judge them either. You know, I think that's the beautiful thing about what we do is we can, you know, inhabit these different characters and, and view them from a non-judgmental space and have empathy for them and the reasons why they say the things they say and do the things they do. Um, and sometimes when we disagree with what their choices are, I think that's the beauty of it, um, uh, of acting really, you know. Uh, John David, there's a part in the film where you guys are talking about, you know, being in these meetings with studio executives and all the things they say and you yourself have been in casting meetings, meetings with executives. What's one of the weirder things that someone said to you in one of those meetings? I can't dish that out. Like, uh, well, let me see what I can, uh, weirdest thing. Um, it's, hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, 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 would you, I, I've, okay, I could say this. What, there was an audition I went on once and they wanted me to, they said, the note was like, can you be bigger? Can you be, you know, he's, you know, it's uh, you, it, just, there's an urban thing, be bigger. I was like, oh, okay, that's weird. That's very <laughs> I know weird. what you want me to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I, I was so tempted to like make them spell it out like, as if I didn't receive the note, like, what do you mean? Yeah, but I, I, like, I didn't have time for that. And I was like, immediately I checked out. I was like, right, this audition is going to be whack because of that. So that was, that was weird to me. Um, one of the themes in this film is gratitude. Right now we are on national television. I'm gonna give each of you time to thank someone that maybe doesn't get thanked in your life as they usually do, or maybe someone you've thought of that doesn't get enough. Zendaya, I will start with you. Who would you like to thank right now on national TV? Who would I like to thank right now on national TV? Um, I would like to thank John David Washington for doing this movie because it was an incredible risky thing to do um believing in it putting his heart and soul into it his money into it <laughs> um but uh, but but honestly for for tackling this character and being one of the most incredible scene partners i could have ever asked for because this is obviously not always the, the the easiest project to tackle and and the the safety and the comfort and the warmth that he also provided um uh as a fellow actor i think was crucial to be, for me to be able to do my work. So thank you, John David Washington for- John David, the floor is yours. Well, I would return that and say <laughs> thank you Zendaya Coleman for allowing me to be a part of you and Sam's life. Um, you know, breathing life into me by uh, having me be a part of this, this project, this beautiful written and executed movie. Um, I think you're a generational talent I think Sam Levinson is a visionary and I think he's extremely talented in what y'all have been doing uh, with Euphoria and what you are going to continue to do. Uh, I am so proud of and I really admire that. And so thank you for letting me have uh, you know, a piece of uh, a piece of the pie. <laughs> thank you. 
Final questions, Zendaya. How the hell Sorry, Andrew, did that's you all guys? The time we have. Okay. All right. I'll ask you next time. Thank <laughs> you, guys. Thanks, guys. Nice Thank you, Andrew. You. I love the movie. Thank you. And cut, please.